just look at that. So good morning, my beautiful friends. It is Friday, finally. We're close to the weekends. I'm having my lovely breakfast right now and work. And then I'm gonna take you through what I got recently. So here's a little sneak peek of one thing that I got for myself. And there we go. What a beautiful package. Just love it. And one last thing. Super excited for this one. So stay tuned. I'm gonna take you through this all throughout the day. Hey there. So, ta-da! It's time for us to do unpacking. And I'm quite excited. I waited for quite a while to share those things with you. I didn't even uh, wear anything once, even though I got it last uh, weekend, but I was a little bit preoccupied uh, to film it. So let's start from this smallest box here, but I needed it so much. Oh, I love it. I love by Terry products. I, I love this brand. I. Like, I love every single product. I tried a lot of, uh, of those products and I got something that has no other similar product there on the market. I saw something similar from Chanel. I love Chanel, but it's not even close to this. By Terry CC Serum. So, let me show you. There it is. My god, it's just so beautiful and gorgeous and I use it every single day. So, what I love about this product is that it's super natural, it like lightens up my skin, brings brightness into it, uh, makes it more alive. Uh, there's a little bit of a shimmer inside but you don't see it like a separate shimmery stuff. Uh, you just apply it and you look more tanned. And what's great is that I love tanning, I haven't done it yet as well, I need to do it. Poor me. Um, anyways, uh, when I, you apply um, fake tan products on your skin, especially on your face, you know there's sometimes an issue of your blackheads being becoming blackheads basically. So uh, you, because your pores kind of get filled in with uh, tanning product, and to me it doesn't look as beautiful. So what I think is a good thing is to apply self tanning products. All over your body but you know avoid your face and use brandy CC serum from by Terry uh, in the color sunny flesh so that your face uh, would look tanned and beautiful and radiant and just gorgeous so love this product highly recommend it will never stop using it I guess hope it's not gonna ever leave the market and yeah the best Okay, moving forward. I'm sorry for <laughs> ruined packaging, but yeah, I traveled a little bit with this. But I went to Victoria's Secret and got myself some panties and something else. So let me share that with you as well. I haven't worn it, so if I would have worn it, I would never show it like on my camera, uh, on YouTube and stuff like that. But so don't worry, it's all, you know. <laughs> Beautiful, never worn. Uh, I just washed it once uh, to <laughs> wear it in the future, but yeah. So, anyways, let's start from the bra. I got myself only one bra from uh, Victoria's Secret. So, why did I get it? Is because I need a bralette um, because I got tired of wearing bras with you know those uh, tightness around your chest area over here, and I was a little bit too tired of that. So, I got the bralette one from Victoria's Secret and I'm quite happy with this one. It looks a little bit too big but in reality it's just perfect and there are no push-ups inside which is great, I don't need it. Um, mine are big enough uh, but you know when I wear it it just it has this push-up effect I would say but no push-ups so super cool. Next up I got an enormous amount of panties and I love specific panties from uh, Victoria's Secret. Uh, I think they're called Cheeky Pants. 
uh, and I think they make your figure and butt look just gorgeous. So I have like an hourglass figure and sometimes you may look at me and think <laughs> that I have a little bit too heavy uh, butt, you know, that kind of area and cheeky pants really um, brings that structure into my body and it really looks like hourglass figure which I do really like a lot. So. So they have like a white fabric that doesn't tupper anywhere and I do really like it. So I got an enormous amount of panties, like black ones, uh, another black panties, but you know, you see they're a little bit see-through, <laughs> um, blue ones, also like ruchy, super nice. Another lacy panties that I love, these are blue ones, also cheeky, the same back and front. Um, green ones, I got green ones, but this is like deep green color, love it. Um, then another beautiful color, but these are a little bit different, I'm not sure, it's not cheeky, it's something else, but I think they're also gorgeous and the color is just beautiful. Uh, white ones, of course, these are not lace, uh, exactly the same as Black ones, another one panties, and yeah, so and, oh, and last <laughs> lace black panties. So I have like one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight uh, panties from Victoria's Secret. And what is good is that uh, obviously they have as Intimacy Me and other brands, they do have discounts, uh, meaning that if you take the same type of panties, I think uh, like the third goes for free or the fifth goes for free. So I do think it's quite good because you do need a lot of panties and I'm so happy with that. Cool. Last but not least. Last but not least is my purchase from Falconeri and I don't think it's going to be the last purchase of this season because I, I like, you know, put an eye uh, on a couple of things from Falconeri but they didn't have my size at that time. I'm not going to disclaim what exactly but probably you will see it soon, let's, let's say like that, you know. But winter is coming and winter in Russia is not like other winter. It is super duper freaking cold and guys I cannot just wear you know trench coats uh, even the, if they are cashmere or whatever like it would be too 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 freaking cold for me in Russia so I do really need a proper um, jacket uh, and let I me mean, tell you if it's cold some, somehow differently so I do do need a winter coat proper winter coat sorry someone is calling Something else is coming soon. It's not gonna be in this video, but I'm super duper excited for this one. I want to film a try on haul. <laughs> Let's see what's gonna go first. I mean, what's gonna go live first. I mean, this video or the Zara try on haul. Anyways, let's get back to Falconeri and my winter coat. So I got myself super duper simple, but high quality winter coat from Falconeri and it is this black winter coat, super warm, I need it a lot, I'm going uh, on my dog walks all the time, like two times per day and uh, as soon as it's gonna be freaking cold, I will need something to warm myself up, but I understand that it's hard to see like that what is this coat about, I will definitely think, put a video somehow, but it's just nice. It's just simple, a little bit oversized, but not too much. And it's it's really simple. I was trying a lot of winter coats and it's so freaking hard to find a proper one that looks good on you. It doesn't look they a lot of a lot of them look really bad. Not flattering, not beautiful. I think this one is super cool. Uh I have a like a coat that I dream of, <laughs> a winter coat from Loro Piana, but 
I'm not there yet, but it's super cool. One day, one day I will have it. Anyways, let me show you. There we go. Okay, this is the coat. And let me try it on. Huh? Maybe we need a little bit more of lightning so that you can see better. Can you? Is it better now? Okay. So it's puffy, it's big, but I don't know, it's just somehow has this structure for it. It's not too oversized. I'm not a big fan of oversized clothes. Yeah. This is how it looks like. Super duper warm and cozy and I love this fabric over here around my... Wait, it's too bright. So anyways, I love the fabric over here um, near my hands and it's just not gonna allow wind to blow inside, which is great. You can zip it over here so your neck is safe. Um, I don't know. It's just great. I just like everything about this one and I can definitely wear uh, a sweater underneath it, anything bulky, which is also good. So, super duper cool. Recommend you. I would definitely prep for winter in advance because uh, by the time winter comes you're gonna be searching and you know running around to find a proper winter coat and it's gonna be so difficult and tough and you can you know you may settle down for something you don't like uh, which is never a good idea but when it's freaking freezing <laughs> you not always have a lot of options so I'm very satisfied with this one and even though it's autumn now I'm telling you you rather go and find a proper winter coat right now. By the way, um, last thing that I did is I also got a bottle um, to wash my cashmere stuff from Falconeri with the discount. So maybe it's gonna be with discount right now for you or wherever country you are in. Uh, if they have it, I, I recommend you to buy it because you know it's important to you know, proper take care of your clothes, otherwise they get ruined and no one wants that. Okay, um, I need to work <laughs> a little bit, but uh, after that I'm gonna go and have lunch uh, with a colleague. Um, it's pretty close to where I live, it's basically in the same <laughs> building. And yeah, I'm gonna catch up with you a bit later. I'm currently moisturizing my hands with L'Occitane, I guess. This is the right pronunciation. I love this hand cream. It's just great. And I also love Caudalie products. I just moisturized also my lips with this Caudalie... Wait, what I'm showing you. With this Caudalie lip balm. I love Caudalie products. Again, they're just great. We took care of ourselves. It's time to work. <laughs> See you soon. Hey there, my loves. Um, I'm getting prepped. Sorry for my hair. It was working. Uh, anyways, so uh, I wanted to say that I'm getting prepped to go and have lunch. Um, but uh, I wanted to share one thing with you. And it is this deodorant from Vichy. It's called Antiperspirant Deodorant 48 Hours. Intense perspiration for sensitive skin alcohol free I read everything <laughs> just just in case uh, anyways this is the best uh, deodorant that I have ever used in my life I think uh, as if like as with the by Terry CC serum I don't think I will ever stop using it uh, this is the same product I will I don't think I will ever stop using this one it is the best for me and uh, this is really really good product um, it's uh, it lasts, uh, it really does the work it should be doing and it's just like no other product. But you have to definitely buy exactly this blue bottle. Uh, so please 
uh, do not buy the white one or any other option out there this is the best okay let's go so I'm such a creature of habit I cannot stop wearing my uh, jeans rich jeans high-waisted jeans from Zara I ah, you cannot see like that anyways I got them in every possible color but wait So now let's put what I need in my bag. Definitely a phone. A... It's not a scrunchie, what's called? Crab? I don't know. Not crab, but crab. <laughs> Ars concealer goes inside. My brush, favorite one. My credit cards for sure let's find where they are yesterday i forgot my keys that was such a mess um, my keys in all of my bags i have enormous amount of uh lip glosses and you know lip thingies now put on my burberry coat my boots on and again i have to run I'm a bit late. There we go. Closing of the doors. Now, this is my outfit. Let me. So, this is my outfit. Super cool and casual. Love it. And I'm gonna run. See you soon. So I'm doing my breakfast and this is a new recipe I'm trying an omelette with coconut milk and stracciatella and tomato paste let's see I found this one blogger posted this fitness blogger so <laughs> it's even better it's quite healthy and nice let's try it out and I'm gonna Cook my broccoli. I've already cut a little bit of um, avocado and a little bit of salmon. Just look at this beauty. Wow. All right, here's my breakfast. I'm pretty sure it's gonna be super tasty. Let's cut the omelette. Hello, my beautiful friends. So, today is um, Saturday. Yeah, Saturday. And uh, we're gonna go to a birthday of a friend of mine. And I decided to try and play with my makeup. And, <clears throat> sorry for that. I have already put the base on. So I have my um, Vitary CC Serum. Um, you know a little bit of uh, foundation um, and yeah so basically uh, that's it that I have and then I was thinking about like playing a little bit with my eyes and um, I'm not a makeup artist but I can still try you know so then I was thinking that I really like the way Irina Shake looks like and she has this like watery smoky eyes in her pictures like this one not sure if you can focus yeah so i was thinking of trying to replicate one of her makeups and just you know giving using this picture as an inspiration and try and get myself makeup done so i have the whole range of all the brushes that we may or may not need uh, it was gifted to me a while ago um, and I also have a bunch of uh, you know eye palettes from Dior, Nars and so on to be honest my favorite one is from Tom Ford but I think we'll try something new today so before we start we want to put a primer on and I'm using my um, what's that I think it's Okay, it's, it's written here cargo 
slash HD, but I'm pretty sure I got it from Anastasia Beverly Hills or just the guy. Okay, um, I've already put it on my eyelids, so let's skip that part. We're gonna use NARS because they have darker colors. So we're gonna use these two dark colors and maybe one on the whole eyelid. First, what we want to do is just put something all over our eyelids. Let's see. It's gonna work. Okay, I'm gonna go with this color. Apply and then put all over my lid. Eyelid. Okay, not bad. <laughs> I'm pretty scared. <laughs> like we can really fuck this up. But okay, nothing is super vivid right now. So we have this color all over my eyelids now she has this like cat eyes and I want to replicate that as well so let's try and do that by taking a bit of these two darkest colors from NARS palette and applying it underneath my eye and you know everywhere where my eyelashes Situated. Okay. Okay, not that bad. Okay, my eyes are situated far one from another. That's what I was told. Do not put anything like whitish um, over here uh, because thus it would kind of, you know, bring the gap between my eyes, which I don't want, so I'm gonna go ahead and um, put this like dark color over here as well. Okay, now I'm gonna put... Oh, you see! You see my eyes! <laughs> now I'm gonna put a little bit underneath my eyes. Oh, I look gorgeous when I do that, but... Now, let's take another brush and blend this. So what we want to do is lift our eyes up a little bit to make them more like cat eyes. So it is always tougher than you think of it, you know, but it could be worse really <laughs> let's do the same with this one all right now oh i really like that i'm doing well let me show you what a genius am i okay so this is the progress so far i'm pretty happy with the result so we're not there yet, we also need to put on some mascara, but we also can bring a little bit of... Okay, let me bring a little bit of sparkle here as well, I think it would be fun. How would we do that is by using sparkles, you know. <laughs> what a funny person am I. Okay, I once got myself this hourglass um glitter eyeshadow what a smart person am i this actually has the like pinky undertone but this time i don't mind it but i think i just need other colors from this what, what's it called again hourglass brand because those glitter eyeshadows are just gorgeous you have to apply them uh, you can you can do whatever you want of course but i like to apply them over um you know my I makeup just to bring a little bit of glitter so I dab my finger inside like so have a little bit here and then simply just put on my eyelid wherever I want a little bit of sparkle I think I'd rather put it even and 
wet. Do not take too much at once. You can always add if needed. I think this is the general rule <laughs> when you play with makeup. You can always add, but it's gonna be harder to remove it. So, so that your makeup looks great, you want to go from the roots to like so, on the roots really, like make this move and then go up and put a couple of layers. This is my trick. Okay, going to the roots and then going up, going to the roots and up. But make sure to get to the roots because otherwise the trick won't work. Okay. How cool am I? I think I'm just doing great. <laughs> what do you think, guys? Did I complete the game of replicating Irina Shakes eye makeup? I think I did. But you can vote down below in the comment box. How smart am I? <laughs> Okay, so I think I'm gonna also put just a little, like I'm, I'm, I'm always doubting if I should put a little bit of mascara over here as well, like on the bottom, or on my bottom eyelashes or not, but I think this time I will put a little bit on the corner over here. Good job! Good job, me. We're done. I forgot to do one thing, and it is to play with my brows a little bit. I think I just, they just need a little bit of shaping. To this alone. <laughs> I watched too much of TikTok. <laughs> okay, I, I took my MAC uh, pen, eyebrow pen. Um, it's called Omega the Lux Brow something and I cannot see it anymore because it's that level right now and just I'm gonna fill in my brows a little bit not too much again just to bring a little bit of color and structure into it really light and simple don't want to put too much really don't want to make them super super duper structured just I'm gonna even look inside my camera focus brushing helps like even the color not exactly brush my brows because they're not that you know nothing happens when i brush them <laughs> let's see how do we like it i like it a lot I think I did a really great job with my hair today. I used my Dyson um, air dryer and styler, whatever. And we also played with my eyes, which is great, which I don't do often and maybe I should. Yeah, I like it. What do you think? Let me know. Okay, um, so today I'm gonna go uh, to the birthday party and I'm not gonna take you with me. I'm sorry about that, but maybe tomorrow I'll take you with me, uh, you know, we're gonna go shopping, I think. But I'm really like scared to tell you that we're gonna go shopping and then we don't go shopping and then, oh, it's just a mess. But yeah, see you then. So there we go. I got dressed, all done, ready for the birthday uh, party. <laughs> But I, did, I didn't do anything special, we're not going super duper out, so I'm wearing like my white Zara jeans that I really love, my also uh, Zara shirt um, that I also like a lot, my diamond set, um, I did my hair, I really like the way they look, I'm gonna wear it like with my bag I think. This bag is used every outfit I think. Wait, you, you have to see the final outfit with my... I'm out and about. I love this trench coat. I just love it. Hey there. Um, it is Sunday. I am more or less 
looking the same. I just changed a bit my outfit because we're going out to the lunch with my friends and then hopefully I'm gonna go shopping a little bit with my mom. So yeah, I'm, I dressed quite simple and cozy. I did fresh uh, layer of fake tanning so I didn't want to put anything white. So this one is my favorite gray off-shoulder sweater from H&M. These are Zara ripped high-waisted uh, jeans. So yeah, this is it. Um, I'm gonna throw on my uh, Burberry coat and I'm gonna run. See you soon. Ciao, ciao. Мы мне все-таки выбираем. Мы со мной нельзя ходить, да? Мы мне выбираем. Снегурочка, понимаешь, должна быть беленькая. Мне выбрали, да? Да.